There's a myth that airplane food tastes bad because airlines don't care. The truth? Your own taste buds are the problem. At altitude, the cabin is pressurized to around six to 8,000 feet with very low humidity. That environment dulls your sense of taste and smell by as much as 30%. Sweetness and saltiness register far less than they do on the ground. That's why airline catering teams overseason food with extra salt, sugar and spices. A dish that tastes almost too strong on the ground comes across as just right in the air, once your senses are dulled by pressurization. So it's not neglect, it's science. Airlines work with food labs and even test meals in pressurized chambers to predict how flavors will shift. The blandness you notice is a biological effect, not lazy cooking. Some airlines go further, tailoring menus to altitude with umami-rich foods like tomato and mushroom, which taste even better in the air. What seems like bad food is actually carefully engineered for a strange environment. So here's the debate. Do you think airplane food is genuinely bad or is it your taste buds that are betraying you?